Hello and welcome to Mass Effect 2, Part 30 something. We will now be going to do Jacob's quest. Finally, after so many episodes of postpone postponing it. I just. Uh, finally, after all this time, we get to go help Jacob. I don't. I have nothing against him, it's just I didn't schedule it correctly. Everything. Just, I kept wanting to do everything else before him, and now we're finally getting to the first loyalty quest besides Kasumi Gato that we done a long time ago. It took a while, but here we are. Finally, with Jacob. Who will we be bringing with us? Let's see. Let's bring Tali. She won't be seeing that much action after this, so may as well. Let's see, okay. Then we have AI hacking, that's gonna be useful. Server's operative, let's get that up. And leave the rest of it away. Now, I may as well bring this up now. This right here is what you get once you complete their loyalty quest. It doesn't have, you don't have to side on their side, but you have to at least complete it. So here we go. Finally, Jacob's quest. SSV Jernsack. They'd have tried to get a beacon up as soon as possible. Along with us anymore, we've done horrible things to the crew. The conditions they're in, they don't understand what we're doing to them. Distract them for two seconds and they forget what, what, what you did before the bruises show. It, it's got to stop. I'm talking to the others as soon as... That's nice. We have beating going on already. So what else is aboard this ship? Let's see if we can find anything. What? What was her name? Sarah? S Suzanne? My god, I can't remember! I can't remember her face! We need to get out. So I can remember. C can think straight. They have to hurry! That doesn't sound good. Uh, what else do we have over here? Well, that's lovely. Let's get this log going while we hack. That's actually very quiet when I'm hacking, sorry. Let me redo it. Oh, we know what that... No, we don't. Sorry, I know what it is. Oh, look at this. Yeah. I, I don't know. Let's keep talking. Activated beacon. From the look of it, this beacon's been here a while. Why would they wait years to signal? Pause in beacon protocol. Eight years, 237 days, seven hours. Pause is recorded as... Record deleted by acting captain Ronald Taylor. That's not right. My father was first officer. Ronald Taylor was promoted under emergency command protocols. Other flagged issues. Unsafe deceleration. Local food and neural decay. Beacon activation protocols. Yeah, let's Come on, just go. Let's get going. My father had a working beacon, but didn't signal for almost nine years. Maybe that neural... 
neural decay affected him. Doubt it. After ten years, it must have. You came from the sky? The leader said yes, someone would falling come. skies. He delayed for so long. We're but he aliens still has in power. disguise. Some have lost faith. The hunters. They will have seen your star. They will not let you help him. Who are you? What was your rank on the Gernsback? Uh, I, I, I can't think. The leader thinks for us and, and we serve. So, so we can go home. But some want to fight him. They were cast out. He exiled them, so they hunt his machines and those who help him. They don't believe that rescue will- Watch out! Hunters, they won't stop until the leader is dead. Kill them! Agents of the liar! He will not escape! Well, this is lovely. Ah, blah, 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 blah. Down. While up against a uh, feral hunters, yeah. people who have undergone no decay. This makes everything better. Okay, come on, Bell Hunter. You're not gonna last that long. Of course you're not. Do -do 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 -do. So this is this is lovely. Acting Captain Ronald Taylor. Obviously Jacob Taylor's father. Because he never knew his father. So sad. Oh well. We're gonna figure out what happened to everything. No decay for 10 years, that's lovely. Now, a lot of people, um, some of my friends included, believed. These now, I know they're different than me, no I, but they just. Fine, tall, they like talking. Let this go on. You two check is very wrong. That's it? Okay. Sorry. I kind of disagreed with a lot of my friends, because a lot of my friends said, Oh, Mass Effect 1 was the best story, which I can see why they would say that, because that Mass Effect 1's like setting the ground, it's setting the, the structure of the series. Better be friendlier than the beach group. But the I actually answers. liked the story of 3 up till the end, and I thought it was well delivered. And 2 is my second favorite, which is, well, hey, what do you know, we're playing that right now, what do you, surprise! These people seem calm, but they're part of the same group as the ones that attacked us. There aren't any men here. Maybe it affects genders differently. Makes males get violent? That's possible, but the woman on the beach said the exiled ones came back as hunters. It doesn't matter right now. One of these people must know what my father has to do with this. You have his face. He promised to call the sky, but he sends nothing. He forced us to eat, to... Decay! You are cursed with his face! You certainly seem to have a way with words. You heard her. I have his face. The hunters will kill you. They fight because he exiled them and waited too long. Hmm. That's lovely. Combat systems engaged. Your captain demands obedience. Weapons okay, this is why I brought Tolly. Hack AI units. Yep. The whole reason just for that. Weapons are forbidden. Weapons are forbidden. Yeah, you're gone. Whoop. I thought there was something someone else we could talk to here, but uh, ooh, let's salvage parts over here. These survivors. Gotta feel sorry for them. Ooh, the doctor's here now. Okay. Have his face, but you fight his machines. You might stop this. This I forget how to read, but this was the start. What he promised and what they did to us. We need the sky. Take us back to the sky. Think on your own time. What's in there? It's a crew log book. Some of them thought the beacon repair was taking too long. They were afraid they'd run out of supplies and lose their minds to the decay. My father restricted the ship food for himself and the other officers so they wouldn't be affected. Everybody else had to eat the toxic food and hope for treatment later. The rest is a casualty list. A few mutinied over the decision. My father and his officers turned the mechs on them. The beacon was fixed after a year, so the plan must have worked. Why no signal? Those weren't the last entries on the casualty list. 
More incidents, harsh punishments. It's like they're cattle or toys. In a year, all the male crew members are flagged as exiled or dead. They separated out the women, assigned them to officers like pets. And after the beacon is fixed, the officers appear in the casualties too. After. My father took control and didn't stop it. It's looking like he only activated the beacon because the men have come back ready to fight. Sweet. He let this happen, and now it's biting him in the ass. Nine years. Why didn't he set it right? I need to find this man.